Welcome back. I'm playing Darkest Dungeon on the hardest difficulty, and I've been just grinding through, getting some guys leveled up since I had suffered so many deaths. And I've camped a bunch of times, and I wasn't getting the shield breaker, and now all of a sudden I randomly have after I fought a boss, and uh, I'm just totally messed up with my stress. So this is not good. So I'm probably not going to be able to beat this, but in case I do. Figure I would try. They also haven't gotten our items back yet, which is unfortunate to say the least. Because what I really want to do is go after the Countess. Nice. A beautiful thing. The knife is dull and I must work quickly. In my panic, I saw hack and gouge. My cries are met with the silent indifference of the dunes, the chill of the desert wind, the cold light of the moon. I am sacrificing my beauty for a chance to live, paying, it, paying for my future with the only currency I've ever had. Okay, kind of jumping around here. I'm going to spend our resources, get this upgraded. An increasing stockpile of curious trinkets gathered from forbidden places. And we'll jump over here. Hmm. We'll get these two things. Don't have enough for that. Did I finish this? I did. Alright, this sucks not having the items. I'm also a little bit worried to fight the Countess with these guys, but I'm going to try. I don't know what items I'm going to need, so we'll just take all of them. And let's take the cures. I don't need that many.
Uh, I think we better just... Uh, I don't really want her to have the minus health. The Countess arrives. Anomalous in aspect and bent on exacting terrible revenge from beyond the bounds of decency. All right, let's give her that. Get that going. Get this healing. All right, so she is blighting. Yikes. A singular strike. A momentary abatement. Whoa, what the hell just happened? Oh, that thing on can explode, I see. Is there a certain amount of turns? I wonder if I shouldn't do this just in case she dies. The ground quakes. Impressive. All right, let's do that. Do this. Heal you. Ugh. So he's got 80 more life. Stop healing. Thirty-three. Twenty-four. Down to five. Damn it. We got her though. Chip tooth with the flagellant. 20 health, move resist, death blow resist, bounty hunter, ooh, minus dodge, that sucks. So if I leave, am I not going to be able to come back and get the stuff? I would assume so. That's kind of disappointing if that's the way they play it. Because you get this key afterwards, and now I can't come back. No. 
nice. Moss covered gates of the courtyard hang open, but the demoniacal pests will spread no further than its blood soaked boundaries. Oh, I can even treat it at the sanitarium. At last, the end of my beginning. That's fantastic. That's huge. Ways of relief wash over the hamlet as the good news spreads. The Countess is dead, and her curse is now curable. Nice. What? All right, we got that. I need an abomination is what I need. All right, so we got rid of all that stuff. Let's get rid of these diseases. See if I can't uh, change some other things here. Light sensitive, we want to get rid of that. Yeah, I figure it's just boring watching me do the same uh, missions over and over again to level some of these guys up, so I did that off camera. Let's get rid of that. Kill the garden guardian. I'll have to do one of those just to see what it's all about. But uh, I'll show you guys this here. Just because I haven't done one of these on camera yet. I need a jester. There we go. And I had been doing it with a man at arms. There we go. And let's remove the items wait that is not a that's kind of a crappy item what I really want is to get my freaking uh, items back and then I got this I don't remember if I got this on camera or not but this is another good thing uh, I guess it increases the stress skills I assume that they uh, stack on each other but I'm not 100% sure Actually, what I should do is use this, and I got this box, which gives us additional stress. I also found this item when I was um, moving around, and this is a pretty good item as well, if you can cancel out the stress. And then this was a really nice item I got too. Um, this uh, allowed me to level guys up a lot quicker, and then when you first move through, the farmstead you'll find a lady there and then she gives you this and this will, you can use this on the miller which is one of the mini bosses inside there and that'll prevent you from getting uh, damage from the reaping which you'll be able to see as an attack of his gives you some speed and also allows you to do more damage to the miller uh, he's not particularly tough I would say alright we'll get that going Take this, take these, take these, take a couple of keys, and we will move out. The poor Miller. Price a victim. The seasons took his livelihood. 
I took his land. And now, uncountable years later, the comet has taken his humanity. My only regret is that I did not live to see that shoddy mill smashed to pieces by the miraculous bounty I reaped from beyond the void. Yeah, there's actually two bosses in here. One's the sleepless. You just kind of come up here, you hit the up button, do this, and you go onward. Eradicated. A decisive pummeling. I think it would be really good to uh, have two uh, highway men on this Precious map to be a hundred percent truthful. But I don't have another highwayman because my guys are so beat up right now. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. These guys are really tough. A devastating blow. Yeah, they can stack some bleeds. As you can see, they can do a ton of damage. So sometimes if they get too stacked on, I just get them off. If you kill these, you'll heal. And if you don't, they'll explode. And you'll get hit pretty bad. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. All right, so he'll die next time. Great is the weapon. Nice. On its own. All right, he'll die next time. Mortality clarified in a single strike. Probably start healing some stress. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. And you got this meter, and when this fills up, that summons you. But the symphony will soon continue. This will heal some stress. And I think it's good to just heal up a little bit with some food while you're here. Let's see, that's going to be 8 damage. I guess I'll do it. A momentary abatement. A dizzying blow to body and brain. Another abomination cleansed from our lands. Diminished. Mm, let's heal everybody. Heal. Alright, you'll guarantee a kill. And let's do that to kill him. These guys are a pain in the butt. Because when they do this, they'll then come after you and they just warp in. And they'll shuffle your guys around. Obliterated. Back to the pit. 
let's see. Uh, let's see if I remember correctly. This heals everybody. Yeah. All right. Let's move out. The stars blaze with hateful light. Gnawing uncertainty. The birthplace of dread. And when they do things like that, I think you should get a counter attack on them. Sedated. All right, he'll die now. The slow death, unforeseen, unforgiving. Start healing your stress. Because it's not like it's because it's a stress thing they don't do it. Because that's a stress one and he gets a counter attack. So I don't understand why some of them get it and some don't. This is the lady that gives you the uh that gives you the item. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. Reality regained. Precision and power. Oh man, you are getting uh, pretty injured here. A 
annihilated. Destroyed. Impressive. of war can be healed, but never hidden. Death waits for the slightest lapse in concentration. Come on, guys, land some of these attacks. Alright, this is good because this is a heat. Because this will heal us. It's a free uh, camp. And then you don't get ambushed. You can use all your points, so boosting up with those guys. Pretty sweet deal. Time has no dominion here. Well struck. Such a terrible assault cannot be left unanswered. Yeah, this is not going well for us. Alright, so he'll be dead. Those guys are scary. Nice. Good, solid hit. Begging for examination. All right, here's the miller. The poor 
pool still stands. Battered and broken. Let's just get that off. <clears throat> I don't think I've successfully stunned him. Oh, that's terrible. I haven't seen that happen before. He just put some healing on that guy. There's the reaping. <clears throat> oh, come on, guys. Really need you to take some hits here. Oh, come on, man. Alright, so that puts a defense on him. That's why I was trying to kill it before. Do that before he freaking heals. Good heal there. There we go. That w I struggled with that a lot more than I typically do on some of my other ones. Do this. Peace. Let's see, we got some debuffs. So let's heal that. Let's move you over here. start good hit Damn it. Oh, shit. Prodigious size alone does not Knew that was going to happen, too. Blade. So I was trying to take him out first.
Passion is a rarity in the fever pitch of battle. Nice resist. The bigger the beast, the greater the glory. This could be bad. Good. You missed. Monstrous size has no intrinsic merit, unless inordinate exsanguination be considered a virtue. Hmm. That's problematic because I can't reach that guy. Alright, so that should kill him then. Their cursed champion falls. A brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. Momentary abatement. Nice. That wasn't great. Damn it. At last, some sheltered corner of reality. Get rid of that. Move onward. Rose of Earth. Filled with blood. Try to drop them. Oh, gosh. Here I am trying to drop this guy, and now he's got another one coming in.
That's not great. A victory. Perhaps the turning point. Soothed. Sedated. from the comet's maddening light. For now, a lost echo trapped forever in the sparkling Try to get this guy down so he doesn't mess all my guys up. I should probably work on taking this guy out so he doesn't stack buffs on me. Can't reach him. He's gonna blow up on me. Is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. Ah, these guys are the worst. Oof. Many fall in the face of chaos, but not this one. Not today. Oh, that was stupid of me. Damn it. Finally.
Should have just healed you. Existence folds in on itself. <laughs> All right, let's roll out. This is uh, a really boring boss battle. It just gets dragged out way too much. Pretty much you'll, you gotta kill him then kill this guy and he'll keep bringing up these uh, crystals here when it gets too high. Then they'll explode. And obviously they heal. Momentary abatement. Compassion is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. Injury and despondence set the stage for heroism or cowardice. This is usually where I end up having to stop after I kill this guy because he just does too much fear damage for me. But when you kill him, you get the memory. Perhaps. 
but I don't want to continue because then I'll end up losing this guy potentially. So in order to get that other building, you just got to keep going through this and just fighting these waves and I don't know. It just seems like kind of a boring thing to me, just fighting these battles over and over and over again. Lord of this place before the crows and rats made it their domain. But the nice thing about it is uh, it doesn't count for your weak totals, as you can tell here. So my guys are still hiding out. Yeah, I guess we'll put you in here. And I can now get this. Wow, no longer suffer random hunger checks. That could be pretty good. That could save you a lot of money in the long part of the game. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to go through and uh, beat that. Because that's just a big... A lot of money right there. So, I guess the thing I wanted to see yet was what are these granite gardens here? <laughs> so, what do I have for an army left? Take you instead. You're a level 5. Do I really not have a level 6 healer? Yeah, okay. Who else do I got? I guess I could take the Hellion out. I haven't shown you guys the him fully tricked out yet, so... I mean, the rest of them, I think you guys have every, seen pretty much everybody else. So, not exactly the army I wanted to use, but we will do it. Now, that's not bad. trying to remember what I used on this guy. I think I gave him the fortifying garlic to prevent him. Oh yeah, I gave him that because now he's got 50% bleed resist. And then I assume the stone guardian is what the stoneworks thing is for. So let's do that. And that's actually a good item for a uh, day uh, torch run with this one. I'll get you this. All right. Looks like everything is Fully upgraded, five for everybody, check your skills out. Yep, alright, let's see what this is all about now. It says it's a medium. So let's do this. Get some shovels, take some bandages, and a couple of keys, I guess. The very grounds themselves are animated by a deep-rooted evil. 
a cosmic hatred for all that thrive beyond its tainted grasp. So I have no idea what this is all about. Ancient traps lie in wait. If I do this, I get another one of those. Sweet. I don't know if I'm going to see like a boss room or how this works exactly. Ah, rough start. All right, that'll kill him. He's actually pretty good. I actually like him quite a bit. All right, that'll answer that question. Oh, no, it's not. It ran out of room. Okay, so I do see a boss battle. That's what I wanted to know. So how is that going to work? Let's do this and this. A chance to steal oneself against the coming horrors. Let's get you that. That'll get you some more speed. Let's keep you going since you're going to be like my. major damage dealer here. Get you some protection. I don't think you have any diseases on you, do you? Did I really just lose that buff because you got moved around? So this stays the same there. I wasn't sure if that's how that worked or not. I don't need the portraits because I pretty much have all the... Alright, so what is this? Shield, Guardian, Font. Okay. Oh great, it's got like tons of resistance, so this guy's going to be not very good against him then. Strike. 
Well, this is going to be problematic, because she's going to not be in the right spot. And I'm suffering a ton of damage. Are you serious? It's just going to keep doing this over and over and over again? Alright, so this was like the worst. He was not a good guy to bring on this battle. Because he does like no damage without being able to stack his blades. Just use a bandage. <sighs> oh my gosh, this is a boring battle. surges as the enemy crumbles. What does that do? Oh, God. Now he's going to start nuking me, really? What does this do? This is not going to be sustainable. Dude, this is stupid. Dated. In 
injury and despondence set the stage for heroism <laughs> or cowardice. Unnerved, unbalanced. All right. Well, let's see if can I retreat. Frustration and fury more destructive than a hundred cannons. All right. Well, that was a disaster. At least I didn't die, I guess. Will invariably lead to defeat. Well, we'll try that again next time. I hope you're enjoying these videos. If you are, please give my channel a like and subscribe. I'd encourage me to post more content for you. Have a great day.